Okay, back again. <coughs> can only put nine. I tell you, you can only put ten minutes up on YouTube. You see, so I have to do them in, in sort of ten-minute blocks. Okay. Um, now, one of the things that disturbs me about this blog is that to see that this is to like the whole site. The um, the uh, this is just too high up. So I'm going to go back to the page. Go to layout, and I want to put a bit more on the top padding. So I'm going to put 50 on there, 50 pixels to drop it down. See how I've taken it, the whole thing down? Now that should... No, it doesn't. So I'll have to... Um, should do it for the whole side, shouldn't it, really? Anyway, 50 is what I'm going to do. If you're going to do a lot of pages that are the same format, and you do a particular format, so you change that particular type of format, one of the things you can do is to click on them, and uh, although this one you can't duplicate, you can duplicate this one. Do you see what I mean? So you duplicate that, you produce a, another one. If I hit duplicate, then it becomes welcome to, and that's got the same characteristics as the first one. So what you do is you make a template, call that template, and um, and then all of the pages that you want to make that are going to be the same as that, with the same layout features and text and so forth, uh, that you just want to change the text or the pictures or a few bits and pieces, just uh, take the template and duplicate it. So now you've got that, then change that to the name that you want. Uh, you know, uh, I don't know, uh, next week, you know, whatever you want to do, and that'll come up then as another page next week. The template itself, you say you go to this page one and you say uh, you can include the nav uh, don't include it in the navigation menu okay keep the dis display the navigation menu so you can see it but if you don't include it then it doesn't get published effectively well it does actually go up to the site but nobody knows where it is so they can't find it so if you want to hide a page while you're mucking around with it just uh, say um, don't put it in the navigation menu and don't link to it anywhere and that page is pretty much unobtainable unless somebody knows you've got template written there and uh, surfs into that very specific page by changing the URL. Well, that's an extremely unlikely event. You can, on the other hand, give the URL to someone and say, look, you can see this particular page. So if you want to keep a page that's, that's only available for your mum or your, you know, your mum and dad or whatever, or lover, um, then uh, you can do it that way. You hide the page so that it's not uh, available. No one will even know it's there, except the person you send the very specific URL to. Ah, oh, God, I love coffee. I drink and eat all the wrong things. Which is why I'm a fat bastard. Um, bastard, by the way, in Australia, is a term of endearment. You must understand that... This is not something that people say nastily. You know, if somebody calls you an old bastard in Australia, it's actually a very nice thing. And if you think I'm joking, ask any Australian and they will confirm it. I know it has nasty connotations elsewhere. Okay, so now we've got... Um, we've got that... Oh, we don't want this picture of this guy surfing. So what we might do is to find... Um, this is rather good. I know I'm obsessed with birds. I understand it. Um, so I'm going to click on that. And there's a nice picture of seagulls there, which I saw. And I thought, don't they look lovely? It's a lot of seagulls. That's an Australian seagull, very different from the European type. And they even make different noises. So now, what a great day it was. Um, and you can change the... Actually, you can't change it on that. You've got to go to the entries. Bit, and you can type in, you know, what happened. Jeremy made a solar-powered car, had a great deal of fun. Didn't win, I don't think, but he, he did very well. I have a feeling the wheels might have fallen off it. Anyway, uh, that's probably not what you worried about. Okay, so um, the RSS, back to this. So allow comments. So this is my blog entry, and I can keep making entries by adding an entry. There's another one. Upcoming is much the same thing, and you go through the whole process again of of how you do it. Um, there's not a lot of editing of the mask by the look of it. You can, oh yeah, you can, you can, you can change this bit. 
and so forth so you might be able to change it like that you can also you can go to the pictures bit this graphics one and you could for instance add a shadow to it right so um, if you click out of it and and just click this uh, you can add a shadow but of course a shadow on black is rather pointless so um, I guess you'd have to I've not tried this but um, You'd have to try a white shadow. Oh, there you are. That looks even. That looks really weird. But if you're on a white background, a black shadow is the trick. Um, you can slip the angle of the shadow around so that it looks different and so forth. And of course, you can whack a reflection on it, and the reflection looks quite quite good from time to time. Here's a reflection of it. But um, we might look. We'll throw another picture on this one. Uh, here we are. I don't know who these people are. As the other kids see, that's where they. That was the track that they had to get the solar car to go to. So, yeah, that's another entry. Um, other people, P E O P L E. And I'm training to be a primary school teacher, but I can't actually spell. So it's a serious worry, isn't it? Okay, um, now we've got that RSS bit. Now, the next one I'm going to do is about using the new. Um, a garage band which doesn't have a heap of changes in it I've got to say um, but what we're going to do is to do a podcast and I'm going to take you through uh, the podcast making a podcast and I'm going to do a video podcast as well to show you that which will show you how to do the um, all of the different things you can do with the video podcast but, uh, but between those, I will go through this this bit, which is the text, um, and not not a lot's changed there, if anything. In fact, I don't think anything's changed there. Um, the wrap, how to use lists, um, which are really good. Uh, the lists are really quite quite nice, actually. Um, the changes in stroke and fill and so forth you can do for objects. I'll take you through that. We're going to have a look at um, the metrics um, one which allows you to change the position and size of objects, rotate them and flip them. Uh, links has been improved enormously. Enable a hyperlink. It hasn't. It still doesn't give you a link within the actual um, page, which is a bit of a, a shame. But uh, what it does do is it allows you to format the, the text um, to uh, get the link to you know what it looks like when you roll over it what they call it uh, a roll over which um, which gives you three different or four different colors um, on the roll over and that's really uh, that's really advanced we hadn't had that before and there's another addition here which is QuickTime which you can uh, use and I'll show you how when you put a movie in how you can make it autoplay you had to actually make a change in the, uh, in the old days to um, the RSS uh, file, but you don't need to do not the RSS, a JS file, a J JavaScript file, in order to do that in 06. But in 08, you don't need to do that. So that's pretty cool. Um, you can loop it, you can show the movie control or not. So with this, you can actually make uh, a page that um, uh, starts music playing automatically and continues to play it without anything showing on the page at all. So if you really, really want to annoy people, this is the way to do it. <laughs> Particularly if you put something like heavy metal or folk music. If uh, they don't, you know, if you've got a heavy metal viewing audience, then put, you know, a Pete Seeger original on. That always gets them going. They love it. They absolutely love it. Okay, I'm signing off and uh, I'll come back and do some more with uh, the. Um, well, I might just do the podcast one next, I reckon, because that's a bit of fun, even though it's not logically. Yeah, it kind of logically fits. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay.